So, hello everybody, and this is my blog for the sort of early part of May. And so the last one was in April, and we've had Easter since then, and the royal wedding, which was beautiful. Uh, so, positive things, or things I want to remark about, you know, sort of on this particular blog. Uh, basically, probably W's, I'm going to mention W's, which is water, walking, and weightlifting. So... Uh, interesting things happening this week, basically lots of people coming in not drinking enough water and I'm probably guilty just myself, uh, I really have not been drinking enough water so I'm upping the older water intake and things are, are really a lot better, energy levels are up, moving a lot better, feeling less tired of an evening time and, uh, and so you know, skin feels better, so water, the first W. Two little clips on uh, this particular blog. We've got one on walking, um, the history of pedestrianisation, which is quite an interesting one, and one on the history of weightlifting, which was fascinating. So I had to put those two on because they are just so uh, positive and really give you an understanding about how important it is for us to sort of like weight train, but also to just like lift heavy weights, whether you're female or male. And it's from Body Tribe, which I've just discovered as a, uh, um, again, American, but hey, who knows, we can have a body tribe over here. Um, but, you know, really female and male, uh, a bit like a CrossFit, but not so much. Uh, just lifting heavy weights, really enjoying the whole uh, process of, of moving and, and using different sorts of implements and uh, lovely sort of different sort of from club bells and kettles and barbells. So, uh, yeah, interesting one. So, yeah, so for me, uh, back into training, uh, some nice weights. This weekend we've got a walking. Um, we're going to go walking up the zigzag, so a few of us are going to start into our, uh, our hill walking again. Evenings are getting lighter, so we can spend a bit of time out there, which should be great. Um, back into my running, my barefoot running. I've got my uh, vibrant five fingers, which uh, I'll, uh, I'll show you later. Uh, and they are just fantastic. I've done some really off-road trail running, uh, they've been really good. And Vibram have brought out some fantastic, um, really sort of uh, uh, aim for running outside uh, sort of uh, trail running shoes. So work, check it out, check it out, really worthwhile. Um, so yes, uh, we've got the Slate Men coming up, which is in Flamberis on the 22nd. Uh, so for those of you that live far away in the world, you won't know where Flamberis is, but it is in uh, North Wales and we're in the Snowdonia area. So it is a, a fantastic triathlon across the lake, a bike ride, and then again a run up the zigzag. So, uh, and a few of my clients are doing that, so great. Um, on the positive note again, lots of people coming with uh, sort of niggling little injuries, and knees and backs, and just seeing how uh, functional training can really help uh, relieve some of those uh, niggly aches and pains, providing, providing, and the underlining word, it's not even a W, you do your homework because you only see me for an hour, some of you, and some of you need to do your homework outside, probably each day. But anyway, it's working, that's the main thing. So until the next vlog, check out the, uh, the videos and uh, enjoy your training, enjoy the day, it's fantastic. So as long as you're moving and enjoying it, that's all I wanna see and hear you do. Okay, email me if there's anything you wanna comment on and uh, look forward to sort of giving you the next vlog. Thanks guys.